Hello traders, it's Monday, December the 19th, and here is our London review. Wall Street continued to keep the three major indexes near record highs last week. But investors have yet to push the Dow Jones Industrials above the perceived magical mark of 20,000. The US will publish important data this week, including the gross domestic product numbers on Thursday. However, trading in the States will begin to dramatically slow down over the next few days as financial houses begin to essentially close for the holidays. The US dollar remains near very strong levels entering this week. The Nikkei has traded cautiously and put in slight losses this morning along with other Asian equity indexes. Tomorrow, the Bank of Japan will issue their monetary policy statement. Risk appetite has been a staple of the trading landscape the past two months in Japan. However, as the holiday season nears, the Asian markets may take on a more tentative tone. The yen has been stronger in early trading today. European equity indexes finished last week with positive movement. While there'll be economic data to watch from Germany and the UK this week, it's likely that the political sphere may have the most influence short term on the euro and pound for investors. Politicians from Scotland have begun raising the idea of holding their own referendum about remaining in the UK as they have expressed concern about the prospects of being forced to leave the EU because of the Brexit. Today Germany will see a business climate reading. Crude oil has created an interesting short-term support level the past couple of weeks. The commodity has put in early gains this morning. Gold has gained the past two trading sessions. However, like all commodity markets, the precious metal may become vulnerable to sudden trading surges as volumes thin. The Flash Services Purchasing Managers Index from the US will be published at 2.45 p.m. GMT and will likely be the highlighted data today. Thank you for watching, have a good trading day and we'll see you again soon.